Hi, this is Arish from jtechnics.com and this is a video series on Google Maps API. In our first video, we looked at fundamentals of map and we created a basic maps using Google Maps API. In this video, we will have a look at how to create markers and how to add info window and to add click event listeners. To add a marker, we need to create a marker object and we need to set few attributes. Let's look at the code. This is a code from our first video. We created a basic map and that looks like this. Let's add a marker to this map. To do that, we create a marker object google.maps.marker and we need to provide few attributes. The first is the position maps.latlong object and provide latitude and the longitude. This coordinate represents the Golden Gate Bridge. The next attribute is the map object that we created earlier. Save the file and let's refresh the browser. As you can see, a marker is shown at Golden Gate Bridge. Next, we can add a title that's shown when you mouse over on the marker. To do that, we just need to add an attribute called title, some text, say click for more details. Save it and refresh. When I mouse over on the marker, it shows a text called click for more details. Next, let's look at info window. A info window is something we can show when you click on a marker. To do that, let's create an object called info window. Google dot maps dot info window and we need to provide the content to be shown. This content can be any HTML code. Say this is Golden Gate Bridge. I can use any HTML tag. Say I will make this bold. Once we create an info window object, we need to create a click event listener for the marker to show this info window. We can do that using google.maps.event.addListener. To add a listener, we need to pass three parameters. The first is the marker to which the event should be added. And the second is the click. This is basically the event that needs to be added. And the third is the callback function. In this function, I will display the info window using info window dot open I need to pass two parameters called map and marker and save the file and let's refresh when I click on this marker I can see this info window showing a text message called this is Golden Gate Bridge to summarize, we created a marker object and then we create an info window and we show this info window when the marker is clicked using the event listener called click event. In our next video, we will look at more, more detail on the markers. We can customize this icon, we can add our own icon and we can have multiple icons, markers, in the, in the map. Thank you for watching. For more video tutorials, please visit jtechnics.com.